Welcome to JAB Stone. I am Joshua in the mayor. Come with me. I am the government person in charge and I represent JAB Stone people. I am the CEO of CB Stock Shop. I am the CEO of Guardsman. I am the CEO of Jabby's Town TV. Today, we will be providing the businesses of Jabby's Town and advertising opportunities, interviewing. Jabby's Town, the newest town in Jamaica located on the Ministry of Education's Canewood property at 37 Arnold Road in Kingston. It was created strictly for children as government sees the need to develop the country's human capital from an early age. The town is a model working economy in which students apply for jobs and are both workers and consumers. This program is called JA Biz Town, Junior Achievement Biz Town, and it originated in the U.S. Um, junior Achievement is, exists in 121 countries, so we're one of the countries implementing it. The initiative which falls under the Junior Achievement Program is being implemented at a cost of approximately $70 million with most of the money coming from donations. Major support is provided by the Rotary Club of Kingston, the United States Agency for International Development USAID, the Ministry of Education and a myriad of private stakeholders. The purpose of this Town is really to teach students at a primary school level about what it takes to work. What are some of the work readiness skills that you have to have? What are some of the business skills that you have to know? When you see a company, you see their product, is it just their product that they have to be concerned with? Or is it what happens behind that? They have to look at salaries for staff. They have to look at operating costs, like paying utility bills. And when your parents leave or guardians leave and, leave and go to work, what does that mean? Where are they going? What type of responsibilities do they have? The program targets 10,000 grade 5 students who are being trained in a localized version of the international curriculum before they get to operate their businesses at JAB Town. They are trained by select teachers who themselves received the training prior to the classroom instructions. These students are facing real life experiences and they're having fun doing it. They're learning math, they're learning to express themselves in English and they're learning how to relate to those who come among them, their customers. And there are many, many other lessons that they're learning. I'm writing out the date and who is the check is going to go to and the sum of money they are going to get. And I'm writing it here in numbers and right here in words. And I'm writing out the account number and my signature. Today our staff at Lime will be installing phones in each business in this town. I'm a cashier. I collect payments from the customers who buy things at Lime. Good morning, how may I help you? I'm going to purchase some, some phone. This one? Yes. Here. Thank you. You're welcome. I am a publisher of Jamaica Yellow Pages. A publisher of Jamaica Yellow Pages design website and send it to other people so they can come and get more information about it. J Biz Town is a true example of involving students so they can learn and develop the skills for a brighter future. I am proud as a Jamaican and I'm a proud member of a government because this is the type of project which needs to be replicated not just here in Kingston, but we hope that we can do others across the country. Yes, that's the next plan of action. The Ministry of Education, along with the Junior Achievement, is working on expanding the program from the current 10,000 grade 5 students to all 42,000 grade 5 students across the island. A plan is also in progress to develop a similar town on the other end of the island, targeting rural students and saving them the long drive to Kingston. It, it showed me how to work with other people and have a great business and it teach me a lot. I learned so far to, to do the lawyer business and, and to write up papers and to do other stuff. I have learned to write checks and I have learned to get money from the bank. All part of the training of our students to be productive professionals for the future. As government continues to focus on the strategic priority of developing our human capital in a bid to make Jamaica the place of choice to live, work, raise families and do business.